Hey guys, Mike Caudill, brand ambassador for Go RVing, and it is Wednesday night. I love Wednesday nights because I get to come on and share with you guys some of the things that we're doing with Go RVing with the Caudills, some of the things happening in the industry, and the most important part are the tips, tricks, and hacks, and things that you might want to consider with your RV. So tonight is really special. We've talked about winterizing, and we've talked about getting prepared for spring, and we've talked about a variety of different things to consider with your RV, but this one is about how to utilize your RV all year round. Because let's face it, we mostly think about our RV in a place like this, a campground. But why not utilize your RV for something else? Case in point, the Caudills, my daughter Megan, she plays club volleyball. And we spend most of the winter and spring months traveling from hotel to hotel every single weekend. So I said to Flora, my wife, I said, why not start using our RV as a way to get to some of these events where we can spend quality time in the RV, utilize the RV, while also staying on track with my daughter's sports. You can use it for baseball, you can use it for softball, you can use it for soccer, whatever sport it is, or frankly, any other activity. Utilize your RV instead of just for camping and vacation purposes. That's why you have it, get the most out of it. Here's what we use it for when we take it to volleyball tournaments. One, think about a volleyball tournament in a big convention center which means a big parking lot. That big parking lot usually means I can tuck away far enough in the back where nobody's gonna mess with us. But here are the great advantages of taking your RV on an activity like a sport. Um, number one, it gives us a place to lay low between matches. So you can walk out of the convention center, hang out inside, and have the comfort of your RV there with you. Two, we got a refrigerator, we got all our food, everything that we need. So we don't have to go to a fast food joint. We don't have to drive to and from the hotel. We have everything contained right where we are at. The third part is actually for the other part of the family. If my daughter is engaged in a couple back-to-back -back games and somebody wants to get away, they can just sneak out to the RV and spend a little bit of quality time in, their, in the RV as well. So there's so many different ways that you can take advantage of your RV. And for us, we like to take advantage of it for my daughter's volleyball tournament. So hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it's more importantly got you thinking about different ways to use your RV uh, here in the very near future. Take care guys, have a great night.